bless my infinite family. God also communicate to us through the scriptures. If you go and read the scriptures in your thought, you go and need this book. It is called Hermeneutics, Principle and Process of Biblical Interpretation by Henry A. Wickler. You also going to need this book, Manners and Custom of the Bible by James M. Freeman. You see, when you study in the scriptures, you need to also look at the Greek definition. And you need to look at the Hebrew definition because the Bible don't go hand in hand with the English all the way. About 60% of the way the Bible gone one way and the English gone one way. They don't agree. For example, a lady wrote, a girl wrote a letter to me. And she said, I know you many years ago. You were so gay. Okay. Now, to understand what she meant, you need to get a dictionary from that time frame when the letter was written to me. And you need to look in the dictionary for the word gay. What it mean in that time frame. And if you look at the word, at that particular word, what it mean in that time frame, it means somebody who was always joyfully, joyous, juvenile, happy going. Taking things easy. That's what it means. If you look at the dictionary today, it will tell you that it is somebody from the... LGBTQ community. So, if you're going to go into the into the Greek, you have to go into the Greek, into the Greek, that time frame, not just any Greek. You have to give pay attention to the time gap. The time it was written, the time it was said. If you're going to look into the Hebrew, you need to pay attention to the time gap. That's the reason why many of the church doctrine is wrong. They don't want men like me in the church. Because too much of the things they have is wrong. Because whoever...